안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. 저는 데나 제입니다. 미국 대사관으로 일하고 있고 지금 외교부에서 일하고 있어요. Hi, my name is Rami Hyun. Um, I'm a photographer. I'm operating the Project Soldier program. This program to meet the Korean War veteran, shoot their portrait and record their history. And of course, this cemetery has been here for 70 years, which is, is quite incredible if you think about it. Um, and more than 2,300 soldiers, UN soldiers, have been laid to rest here. Um, so it's a, it's, I think it's a really important place, not only to South Korean people, but to the world. I knew that this is the only place in the world, only UN cemetery place. There, there's nothing like this. Mm. And I think, you know, as an American, it's a particularly meaningful place as well. I mean, we had more than 1.5 million Americans serve in, in, in the Korean War. Also, well. so 36,000 KIA and 7,000 MIA. Yeah, so to have a place like this to come and to commemorate that, not only from the Americans, but the other 22 UN countries as well that, that really made those um, incredible contributions and sacrifice, I think, is, is so meaningful. Yeah. Mm. The time was the freedom was the best value and the best idea in the war, mm. and they just come to here to protect the freedom. You know, and when I'm in a place like this and I'm reminded of those sacrifices made by the UN sending countries, uh, and in particular um, by the United States, it just it reinforces for me the value and importance of the USROK Alliance, not only back uh, to, the, to the time of the Korean War, but today as well. And, and I'm, I'm sure you saw the recent photo of President Moon oh, and President Biden exactly. uh, conveying the Medal of Honor. Yeah. Their photo symbolizes the US and Korean Alliance. Because uh, we are here because of that U.S. Army Colonel, mm. Rob Prickett, mm. he deserved it. You know, and for me personally, when I contemplate this place and the origins of the U.S. ROK Alliance and that strong security pillar, I'm so uh, impressed and thankful. And yet today, it has evolved into so much more. If you think about the people-to-people -people ties through the work you're doing, for example, uh, but also the economic um, ties and cooperation and opportunity. I mean, look at the COVID-19 response in South Korea has been phenomenal, and there's been some great collaboration there. I think health diplomacy, uh, also looking at um, climate change issues as well, space technology and exploration. It, we really uh, celebrate the fact that the Alliance has evolved into such a dynamic and myriad um, just combination of, of linkages between our two peoples. And I, I'm, I'm so thankful that this helped to um, protect that and to safeguard it, and that now it's grown as much as it has. And it is so strong today. And to ensure that we remember how we got to where we are today, not only in Korea, but in other countries as well. And, and I, I'm really looking forward to seeing your exhibit later today to learn more about that. Sure, thank you so much. This is amazing. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for having me here today. Thank you so like that. Yeah, I, I've seen your, your photos online and I was so impressed with them, but I have to say that now that I'm actually here in the exhibit hall, that there's sort of a, a feeling of significance uh, that, that you can't help but, but, but feel when you come in. The reason the exhibit is so important. Internet, it can be, have interesting things, but actually photo exhibition, Something like that when you see the eyes and when you see the feels, so they can change the mind. The reason I think this kind of experience is so important to change the mind, the people about the Korean War veteran. Mm, absolutely. Can you tell me a little bit more about how you started this? Why, why you started this particular project? Everything is one question. Why those veterans have such a pride? Where the pride came from? 
because they didn't Korean War is their own country, is another country. They traveled half in the war, they fight the, for something. I don't understand. Because it makes sense, rock Korean veteran, they stay their own country. But UN veteran is not. So I don't understand. And what was the name of that particular soldier? Sal Scarlito. Mm, I remember that photo. It's quite impressive. Yeah. Everything is one person. He wore, he just introduced himself a Korean War veteran. It's impact to me, the curiosity. And next one is, I just want to ask him, why is you have such a pride? And after that, I have a chance to meet another UN veteran. But I didn't ask anything, I just take a picture. But when I see the piece, their pictures, portrait, same pride in the photo. And it was very curious to me, it was very wondering. So I decided to travel to find them, to ask why, why pride came from. The Project Soldier is kind of a journey to find out the answer about the pride. When I look at the book that you've created, when I see these beautiful portraits in person, I can't help but think of the impact you're having on their lives, meeting them, helping them to have renewed meaning, uh, many of them uh, close to the end of their lives. Uh, and I think that's such a beautiful gift that you can give back to them. And um, I, I just, I, I'm in awe of your selflessness, your sense of service, your sense of how to commemorate and honor these individuals. I, I think it's, it's amazing. I think I'm just the messenger that deliberates one passing to the next generation. My teacher told me, photography just want to capture the present things, deliver the next generation. I think I'm doing that. So tell me, how are you able to do all of this? How are you, how are you funding this project? Uh, still now, this is just a personal project, still from the, in my pocket. But a lot of Korean people can help this project not stop it. So I wish more company another country get together because they see the, they feel that how important the Korean veteran. But before too late, I just want to go together, especially a Korean government, United States government. We pick it together, we can make the more Korean veteran. We can record more and more and more for the next generation in history. What does success with this project look like? What does, what, what do you see yourself doing in the next few years? 2023 is the seven year anniversary Korean War Amsis. So before that, I would like to travel whole 22 country to thanks to about their service. They captured their portrait and they record their story, make the archive. So we are lucky people to see and meet and listen their own story. But as long as Korean and United States keep going, we need their message, we need their record and history. So I wish I keep doing this work until 2023 with the more Korean better. Yeah, I think that's a really worthy goal and I wish you all the best in reaching it. I'll try best. Rami, thank you so much for spending time with me today. I learned an incredible amount and you have an extraordinary exhibit. Thank you so much for coming over here. I'm so happy to you talking about the Korean or Korean better. 만나서 너무 좋았습니다. 저도 만나서 너무 좋았습니다. 감사합니다.